So I think today I'm going to make some white chocolate chip macadamia nut cookies. And pretty sure that they are gonna turn out great. In one bowl, I'm going to do one cup of brown sugar. Also one cup butter. I'm just gonna kind of eyeball this one because I don't want to use it yet. So I'm just gonna measure out one cup butter. That's about one cup. Some of the things that they are getting cookies as well. Now about two thirds cup of granulated sugar. So I'm going to take one cup, fill it about two thirds of the way. So that's about two thirds of my one cup. Use that. Now we're going to cream together all of this. We're just going to cream all of that really good. Now it's time to add two teaspoons vanilla, two eggs, a little salt. So once this is all creamed up and good looking like that, and add salt, not very much. And then two eggs, two, okay. Now two teaspoons vanilla. There's one and two. Now we're gonna blend this. Why are you in here? No, no. Excuse me, why are you in here? No. You're getting no cookies. Why are you coming in here? What? No cookies. No, not for you two. I'm gonna mix all of this together, and then afterwards, I'm gonna add flour, baking soda, baking powder, and cornstarch. In a separate bowl, I'm going to add flour, cornstarch, baking powder, baking soda. So, two and a half cups of flour, there's one cup, one cup, two cups, two and a half. Okay, one tablespoon cornstarch. You don't have to use a separate bowl for this, I just do it just because it's probably gonna be easier. Tablespoon cornstarch. Good to go. Half teaspoon baking powder. I'm gonna use about what I think looks good. A pinch, more than likely. Mm, two pinches, that's enough. Teaspoon baking soda. Remove this into this. We're done with these. Put them over here with everything else. Now we're gonna move the flour into the other mix. Okay, pour the rest. That's all blended. I'm gonna stir in my chips and nuts, about a cup and a half each. Crush them around a little bit and then we're gonna stir them in. At this point, preheat your oven to 325. Okay, so it's about this much. We're gonna chop them up 
not like thoroughly, it doesn't matter. They just need to be a little bit chopped up. Use the back of the pan. And I'm gonna beat these suckers. Probably scare the crap out of my dogs too. I'm gonna lay the bag on top of my kitchen towel. <laughs> I'm gonna lay them like that. I'm gonna use the back of the pot. I'm gonna beat them for a minute. Um, just to get the little like bigger pieces a little bit smaller, probably in half. So now the macadamia nuts look like that. I'm gonna add this bag. I'm gonna add about a cup and a half white chocolate chips to the mix. We're gonna fold it in and then that's gonna be the entire cookie. Also, don't forget, you gotta get cookie dough on your wall to make everything better. Why are you here? Excuse me, miss. What are you doing? Beavles. What are you doing? Hey, see you. Yes, yes, you. I'm talking to you. Yes, I'm talking to you. What are you doing being creepy right there, you monkey? What are you doing? Hi. Okay. Go and get so I can wash my hands. Go. No, not for you. No cookie. No cookie for you. Oh, no, no, no. One cup and a half. About. Hmm. So now that everything's together, I'm going to fold it and hold it these bad boys because yum. Why are you in here? What are you doing? What? Not for you. I have a baking sheet with parchment paper on it, and what I'm going to do is transfer everything that's mixed, all the cookie dough, onto the cookie sheet. The oven's done, it's preheated, it's ready to go. Using a spoon, I'm going to spoon out the cookie dough because it's super sticky and thick onto the cookie sheet. That's how the little dough ball is supposed to look like. Not very big, but not very small either. So spoon, cookie dough, onto the cookie sheet. These are what they look like and I'm going to put them in the oven for 10 to 11 minutes or until like the edges are brown, golden brown. In the meantime, I'm going to drink my coffee out of my dog cup. There's Bubbles, there's Trixie, these two. I got a cup with their faces on it. I got this cup for Christmas last year and I have to say it's one of the cutest cups that I own and I love it. And look at my dog. This is so cute. This is my other dog. So cute. And it has mine and my boyfriend's name on it. So cute. These are so fresh and they smell so good. It's ridiculous. Now it's time to add some more dough. I just took a bite of my cookies. It's seriously like biting into a cloud. It is so soft, so chewy. Wow. Not for you guys, no. No. What do you know? You can be, oh my god. You can be cute as you want, but you get nothing. Oh, no, 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 no. You neither. Do you see? Uh, this batch a little bit large. But they'll be good. Why are you standing here? You get nothing. Why are you here? No, 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 no. I no, 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 I no, no, no. What? You both get nothing. Why are you here? No, go and get out of the kitchen. Come on. At the kitchen. I know, you be a good girl. Get me bed. What? You crazy bitch. What? Why are you like this? Trixie, hey, Trixie, enough. 
Enough. Enough. What? What? Why are you crazy? Why are you crazy? Hey. 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 Chill. Chill. Why are you guys like this? Get in your bed. Get in your bed. You have a cute little bed and you choose to be on the sofa and mess with each other. And walk on my purse. You have a cute bed. Use it. So these are the end results. Yummy yummy cookies. They are white chocolate macadamia nut. They're like little clouds. You can make them however big or however small you want to. If you want to prevent the sticking together or touching whenever they're in the oven, just spread them apart more, about two inches and be sure to cook them on 325 for 10 to 11 minutes. This is the final result, a plate full of macadamia nut white chocolate cookies. They're hot, they're fresh, they're cloud-like, they're really good, so good. Make them for a family event, birthday parties, I don't know, Thanksgiving, Christmas, who knows, but they are so good and soft. Are the perfect cookie, for anyone to have, take any event. One recipe makes all these cookies plus those in the oven. Try the recipe, see how you like it. They're really good, they're tasty. Try the recipe, see how you like it. They're really good, they're really fluffy, they're cloud-like. A lot of chocolate chips, a lot of sugar. So if you're on a diet, don't make these because there's a lot of sugar, a lot of butter, a lot of everything that someone on diet won't eat. If you want to go to an event, if you want to go somewhere, if Christmas party, Thanksgiving party, Halloween party, birthday party, Easter, I don't know. Make them. Try it. They're really good. Just make them just because you're watching a movie and you feel like making something. Who knows? Bye.